Hey there, Brian Hutchison, Global Career Guy here for another episode. I think it's important to remember the what this vlog is all about, which is really a diary or a catalog of the life of a gigging career services professional, i.e. me. Um, and so it's not all how-to, it's not all ideas, it's not all interviews. Uh, today feels very personal to me. I, I want to talk about the resounding effect of gratitude. So this has not been the easiest week for me. I have two big projects that are not going well in my mind. One is personal, which is uh, better health and fitness this summer, uh, trying to lose a little bit of weight that my doctor suggested that I lose, and I've had a bad couple of weeks in that regard. And then the other is, is a large ongoing uh, project uh, where I am feeling distracted, I'm procrastinating as a, as a defense mechanism, I'm frustrated with technology and my inability to get a good process going, and I really feel like I'm leaving some colleagues down all over the world. And so... You know, no matter how much therapy we go to, no matter how much we uh, get a sense of command and mastery over our work, there's still going to be these lull periods um, of frustration, of procrastination, of just low energy and low focus. Um, so what does that have to do with gratitude? Um, I, I've just had an unexpected influx of gratitude in my professional life this week. I've actually made notes about it. Um, it started on Monday when someone who I've never met before that's been following the vlog and following me in my new social media presence asked if we could do a call to talk about their career future. And, uh, you know, the gratitude part for me was is just the validation of what it is that I'm doing. And then the enthusiasm of connecting with a person I didn't know around this field and feeling, I think, like I've been pretty helpful in, uh, in a moment of advisement and focus and confidence in moving forward. I also heard this week from a current student that just graduated in May um, who I did some coaching with. We did some resume work. We did some interview uh, prep, mock interview stuff, uh, who got a great first job as a clinical mental health counselor here in the New Jersey area. And as I spool it back, um, my social media presence has helped me uh, connect to a colleague who I've known for many years, but I've always wondered, like, what is, the, what is the meaning of this connection, and are we really even connected? So even a quick back and forth, uh, and knowing that that person is invested in knowing me and interested in this work is very, uh, very rewarding. But it continues to spool back. Um, uh, a student, or I'm sorry, a professional, a school counselor, uh, who I worked with uh, as their supervisor last year, uh, is, to my knowledge, the only school counselor I know that works in an Islamic school in the United States, and taught me so much through our clinical supervision uh, about that work. And then finally, Facebook has given me um, a message from uh, eight students that I took to New York City as part of my cultural immersion model five years ago. And so a Facebook memory has spurred on gratitude from them and reconnection after five years long past. So this isn't just to say, hey, all of these people express some sort of thanks or validation to me this week. It's that their um, sense of gratitude and expressing that actually has a resounding impact on me. It was the perfect antidote uh, to, the, to the problem or the suffering that I was having. Uh, and it's the perfect reminder of that uh, we don't know who, when, and where our work will impact another person and who, when, or where will reach out and let us know about that. And so I feel grateful to them uh, because of their gratitude for me. And we have many metaphors for this, the pebble in the water and the resounding ripples, the planting of seeds metaphor. Uh, there's plenty of research about how gratitude uh, helps with our sense of well-being, our sense of purpose, uh, having a positive mindset and our resiliency. But at the end of the day, I just wanted to take this post and thank the people who gave me the gift of gratitude this week. And so thank you to... Chris Dunkers, Kent Butler, Nora Laharby, Pradnya Shinde, Connie Leung, 
Katrina Allen, Adrian Thayer, Kimberly Rudy, Aisha Johnson, Brittany Collins, and Robin Daniel. They are 10 or 12 people of the thousands for which I feel a sense of gratitude and gratefulness in what they have done for me in my career and in my life. And so stay tuned, please. Um, if you follow these videos, it seems like hundreds, if not thousands of people are watching them on LinkedIn. Please follow my YouTube channel, Global Career Guy, uh, so that I have some sense of the number of people that I'm interacting with. Brian Hutchison, Global Career Guy. Until next time.